fighting them off. What's this? Whoa! What the... I'll be taking this. If you get too hung up on fiddling with it, we'll never get out of here. I'll give it back once we return safely. Uh, <laughs> if you say so. But it's still so far. Think we could jump? Only one way to find out. Well? <laughs> okay, maybe not. Hey, watch out! Don't scare me like that. Sorry about that. Well, we definitely can't make it from here. There should be a connecting point somewhere. Let's go back and see what we can find. Huh. You don't suppose... Huh? There. Take a look. Hmm? Go on. Look closer. Come on. We don't have time for this. Let's cut the fun and games, all right? Oh! Then let me explain. As you see... Ugh, forget it. Let's just go back down there. <laughs> you never could handle losing. I see. So that's the deal. Who would have thought that you could walk in mid-air here? Or that an invisible bridge would be here. Think it could support a person? Well, well. Aren't you sharp today? <laughs> For a change. Psh. Seems safe enough. Yeah. This bridge is incredible. How do you think it was made? 
I think this is beyond the capabilities of human technology. So, like, the bridge alone might date from the era of the gods? Possibly. But either way, they definitely had assistance, whether from Seraphim like me or someone else. They really didn't want anyone to reach the other side. The path ahead leads to Elysia. It stands to reason that they do what they can to protect the Pure Land. In the past, any pilgrims who showed up at the shrine probably thought the gap was simply uncrossable. Same as we did until just minutes ago. But good job picking up on that. Your intuition is always impressive. Oh yeah? For its rarity. There we go. I knew it was too good to be true. Maybe we should rethink this. Hey! Uh, are you alright? Uh, huh. <sighs> I was... I was in a forest, and then... <sighs> Looking for this? <sighs> 